Welcome to logging in with Active Directory on Windows 7. This tutorial is going to walk you through the steps of logging in with Active Directory using your username and passwords, logging out, and also switching the username in the login screen. Now if you watch the tutorial on how to log in Active Directory using Windows XP, this will go over very similar information. When you walk up to a computer screen, you're most likely going to see this screen here. Go ahead and hit Control Alt Delete, and this will bring in the login dialog. This will show the most recent user to use this computer. It'll show that they're logging into the Trinity domain, and it'll show their username as well as a place to put their password. We're going to use a different login, so we're going to go ahead and down below this and hit the Switch User button. And this will show again on the left the last user to log in and on the right a place to select another user. We're going to go ahead and uh, log into Trinity, the domain. So we're going to type in uh, our username. We're going to use holly.woods. And now we're going to type in our password. This will be the same username and password that you would use on the Windows XP system. As you can see, the desktop on Windows 7 is very similar to the Windows XP uh, with a slight modification on a few elements. But down in the left hand corner, you have the Start menu. Go ahead and click that. And up at the top, you can see your username and access all of your documents and programs. Now, down at the bottom right hand screen, you have a button to shut down. Click the arrow to the right, and it'll bring up this dialog where you can log off. This brings you back to the start again. Thanks for watching this tutorial. In this tutorial, you've been able to see how to switch users uh, within the login screen, log out, and also log in using your username and password.